एवरीवन वेलकम टू चलचित्रा टॉक्स मेरा नाम समीधा है टुडे आई वांट टू टॉक अबाउट एंड रिकमेंड टू यू अ बैंड हुज म्यूजिक इज़ वेरी इजीली प्लीजिंग टू द ईयर्स एस्पेशली इफ़ यूर अ फैन ऑफ इंडी म्यूजिक एंड मोर स्पेसिफिकली द बेडरूम पॉप लो फाई एरिया ऑफ इंडी म्यूजिक द बैंड इज़ कॉल्ड फार कैसपियन देर अ थ्री मेम्बर बैंड फ्राम इंग्लैंड यू शुड चेक आउट दिस बैंड ऑल्सो इफ यूर इन टू बैंड लाइक मैन आई ट्रस्ट Uh, the Marias, Beacon School, and such more similar indie bands. I came across Far Caspian because of this YouTube channel called David Dean Burkhart, and this is one of my go-to channels when I want to find some new uh, indie bands making amazing lo-fi, dreamy music. Uh, two more channels that I rely on to find nice indie bands are Lazy Lazy Me, and I'm a cyborg, but that's okay. And Far Caspian has been featured. in all three channels um and these channels also sometimes make their own videos for uh, songs by such bands and they're so nostalgic the like the theme of most of these videos are very nostalgic um very dreamy and yeah are definitely worth checking them out far caspian is fairly a new band they were formed in 2018 but they've already become quite famous in the indie genre most of the songs uh sound very chilled out and have an overall happy vibe but if you look at the lyrics and the themes of the songs they're mostly serious and melancholic there's just the kind of music that you would want to listen to if you want to feel more calm uh, peaceful relaxed but at the same time music that can get you introspecting about your own life because a lot of the themes that this band explores are something that would be relatable to anyone The music also has a very major 80s vibe and one more reason why I love this band is because um they program the vocals in I think almost all their songs to sound hazy and distant sounding so because of this distant sounding quality um I think it adds to much more dreamy vibe in their music I want to start by recommending some songs from their first EP titled Between Days Uh, and in this EP, the songs explore different themes such as solitude, vulnerability, um, letting go of a loved one, loneliness, leaving familiar conditions, leaving familiar surroundings, leaving home. But to true to their signature style, they the songs still sound overall light and happy. I want to recommend three songs that you should definitely check out from this album. The first song is called Finding My Way Home. and this has to be my favorite song of the album i relate a lot to the theme and lyrics of the song and anyone who has left their home country or even home city and moved to a foreign place to reestablish again um like you you leave your familiar surroundings you leave your friends and family and you go to a new place to reestablish all of that again to find all of that again um this song explores more of that the next song that you should check out from this album is called let's go outside and this has a very motivational and hopeful theme around it and it's about um accepting like letting go of a bad habit or bad situation in your life and taking that very first difficult step uh towards making a change in your life Uh, the last song that you should check out from this album is called Blue and this song is about letting go of a loved one and yourself accepting that decision. Next, I want to recommend some songs from their second EP titled The Heights. Um and if I have to choose one EP um uh, and recommend one EP to anyone who's exploring or listening to this band for the first time, it would be this one. Uh all the songs in this EP are definitely worth checking out. Uh this EP combines their signature bedroom pop melodies but with a more uh synth heavy sound in comparison to their first one Between Days and also another difference between Between Days and uh The Heights is that this one has a more groovy hopeful and joyful theme uh in comparison to Between Days which had which was focusing on more melancholic um and serious themes Again I will recommend three songs from this EP that you should listen to. The first is called A Dream of You. Uh it has to be one of my most favorite songs from the band. Uh this song is the again the the signature sounds of like distant vocals along with the instrumentation 
whenever i listen to this song it just makes me want to close my eyes and like just sway around it it's that kind of song it's a very has a very groovy melody has a very joyful melody that's again very pleasing to the ears the next two songs that you should check out from this ep are conversations and uh, the heights so if you're someone who enjoys lo-fi music uh, but who also focuses on lyrics and does like melancholic and serious themes then far caspian is one band that you should definitely check out um if you do listen to all these songs and like these songs then i would highly recommend that you go and also specifically check out their lyrics um and try to figure out what you feel about them so these were all my recommendations for far caspian i would love to know what you think about the band um and i'll be back next week with another recommendation